Hey everybody, welcome back to the Wake Up Call here on LoadedTV.com. I'm Natalie Jones, and I want to remind you guys that you sh if you can at all, please go and uh, you know all of the people who have commercials and are sponsors of us really need you to go to their businesses, um, and that includes Roller Kingdom and Jazz Louisiana Kitchen and our great hairstylist Candy um, and the Isles. All those guys are supporting us, and so if you can support them, uh, and we would never steer you wrong with uh, you know vendors. Um, they're really great. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to do a quick craft. Now, this is super easy to do, and it, this, all it requires is stuff from your kitchen. Okay, so what you're going to need now, here's a, this is a great lesson. Not only is it about cons conserving, everything that you're going to use is all natural, so the kids are going to love it. It's really, really safe. I mean, you could just eat this stuff. It's so safe. This is a really good way. In the wintertime, birds and small animals, including squirrels, birds, different things, they, they don't get a lot of the things that they do in the summertime. So it's up to us to make sure that we're giving them water as well as something good to eat. And they will love this treat. And if you have birds that are um, not wild and you want to give it to them, it's perfectly fine. All you need is an orange. And what you're going to do is you're going to take your orange and you're going to cut it in half. Now you want to make sure you cut it in half. Not You want the navel. You see the little navel? Beep. You don't, you want to turn it so that you have the two sides and you're going to cut it in half. And this is what I did is I cut it in half and then I took my knife and go all around the edge like this and pull out all of the segment, the orange segments. And then you can eat those or squeeze them for, I don't know, orange juice or something. And then go ahead and take a spoon and scoop out all of the flesh. And if you have a little bit in there like I do, that's okay. It's fine. It's not a big deal. All right. So once you've done that, you're going to need just a few more things. And I'm going to show you. We're going to need peanut butter. Yummy. Now, I have Skippy. You could use chunky peanut butter, all natural. It just kind of, you know, uh, this does have sugar in it, so probably all natural would be a little bit better. And then I have some sunflower seeds. You could also use raisins. Um, they love fruit, birds and, and little guys like those squirrels and stuff. Um, so you, uh, you're going to use this, and that's perfect. Now, what you're going to do is in a little bowl, you're going to take, ah, uh, peanut butter. So good. Now, the smooth and creamy is a little easier to like work with, but um, if you want to use the natural chunky kind, if that's the kind you have, go for it. The birds don't care. And they do, you know, um, sugars for them, is, they're, you know, they're fine. Um, okay, a little bit of sugar never killed anybody. All right, now uh, you're going to go ahead and add some of your sunflower seeds. Whee! And you're also going to add um, any other fruits that you want. You could put bird seed in here. You could put, you know what you actually could put in here? Um, like fat from, like, maybe not gr like grease, but if you had maybe some beef fat, you could add it in there. Chicken fat. They like it. Maybe, does that cannibalism? I don't know. All right. Then you're going to mix it up. Now, if it's a little bit hard to mix, like if you've got that real um, hard, you know, like the natural peanut butter that doesn't really mix very well, you can always add just a tiny bit of water to it and um, make it a little more smooth and a little easier to mix. So mix it all up. And then you're going to add it to your cup, right? And you're just going to spoon it in. And they love this stuff, you guys. Love it. Don't make it too, too full. I kind of like to add a little sprinkling of, let's give them a little extra here. And then, so sprinkle it on. They're going to love you. Now make a few of these because, um, you know, you're making them already, so make like four. Get two oranges, make four. And see how that is? Now, oh, shoot, you know what I forgot to tell you guys? I forgot a step. All right. So what I should have done was, before you fill it with peanut butter, sorry, you want to take, I have like a wooden skewer that I have, and poke holes on the sides. Sorry about that, guys. Poke the holes in the sides and make them big enough so that you can either put like string or cord. Um, I'm using raffia, right? So I'm going to fill this one up. And so what I did is I took my raffia and I just um, tied it on either side of my little orange cup. And I would have should have done that on here. And that was stupid. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and fill it up. Then fill it up with your mixture. So let me take some out of here. And then just go ahead and hang these out in, on your tree. Go and put them outside. And uh, let the birds eat them, and they will love you for it. Also, if you, if you can, if you love birds, birds really need water in the winter. So isn't that cute? And then you hang it on your tree. He's so cute. 
Um, birds need water in the winter because a lot of their water gets frozen. So if you have like a little heated bird bath, they would love that. Um, what else do they like? Um, they like you can hang these. You can get a big pine cone and spread it with peanut butter and like bird seed, and they love that. And you just roll it in the bird seed, and they will absolutely eat it up. And I've made these many, many times, and I set them outside, and it is just really fun to watch birds um, and you know figure out the different ones, little finches and sparrows and swallows and all the different robins and uh, such as you have. All right, that's my craft. Feed the birds. It's a good thing. All right. Um, oh, that I just stole from Martha Stewart. Um, make it a great day. We'll be right back after this from the wake-up call. Tweet, tweet. Hmm, sounds good.